Celtic were looking to go top of the Premiership in the lunchtime kickoff at Rugby Park. Samaras. Well won by Rabi Ibrahim. Now Closey. Good ball in by Closey for Chris Boyd. And it just hit Fraser Forster. He didn't know too much about it. Well, Chris Boyd has never scored for Kilmarnock against Celtic. Came close there. They don't come much bigger than Tuesday night against Barcelona for Celtic, but they have all eyes on this fixture for now, and that's a mistake by Sampson. And there's Chris Commons to open the scoring for Celtic. It's his fourth goal of the season, but really, Craig Sampson had to do more with the punch. Once it dropped to Chris Commons, he still had a lot to do, but he finds the back of the net. Samaras did brilliantly to tee it up, but there is a question mark over Sampson there. Commons given away, but won back by Mulgrew. Matthews. Samaras, oh, what a finish! Brilliantly hit, first time on the volley. Controlled and curled into the corner of the net. What a delightful effort. Georgia Samaras has scored three goals in Europe this season, but that's his first in the league. Samaras. Oh, and still, took Commons alongside him, and he uses Chris Commons, who returns the favour. And it's a wonderfully crafted third for Celtic. The two goal scorers combine the power of Samaras, the vision of Chris Commons, and that allowed for a simple finish. That is a very well taken goal. Three goals in the space of seven minutes for Celtic. And they look home and dry. What's oh, Klingon? That's a great free kick from Sammy Klingon. It's his first action of the season. He's been out with a knee injury. Scored twice last season since joining Kilmarnock. And that was perfect. Closey. Breezes past Izagiri, back to Closey, it's 3-2 now. Well, Celtic looked to have this game done and dusted. Kilmarnock have other ideas, as they still look for their first win of the season. Gardine with the return ball, Closey with the finish. Izagiri will need to do better than that on Tuesday night against Danny Alves. Izagiri, this is Timo Puki, oh, well hit. And off the top of the crossbar from the Finnish striker. He scored two and two in the league, almost three and three. Mulgrew's free kick, Samaras, that's the hat-trick. And two minutes from time, Celtic eventually make the point safe. And it's Georgios Samaras with his second hat-trick for the club. His last one came almost exactly three years ago against Inverness. And he just stooped to direct the ball beyond Craig Sampson. Lustig. And it's Baldi. He's got Stokes alongside him. Chooses not to use him. Chooses to go it alone. And Amido Baldi has Celtic's fifth and his first for the club. Didn't he enjoy it? Well, he pretty much had to make sure that he found the net after not playing in Anthony Stokes, because that was the easy ball. Balde went it alone, and he did score. And it's a memorable moment for the Portuguese striker. Kilmarnock two, Celtic five.
subscribe now for free and catch all the action on SPFL YouTube.